Greetings. I recently listened to the debate John Rankin versus Fred Phelps is available on Westboro Baptist Church's website and also you can get it on YouTube. I personally heard it on YouTube. Now I was interested what was the point of John Rank debating Fred Phelps? What was he trying to achieve? Was he like many wimps out there trying to get an easy victory? After all, Fred Phelps is the ultimate evil person in society, so beating him is a very easy thing to do. Interestingly enough, his performance on the debate wasn't that great. You see some of the comments on the YouTube page, how people actually noted that Fred Phelps made some points. I noted that I noticed that the moderator scolded John Rankin for being attacking Fred Phelps more than he scolded Fred Phelps. I don't even remember him scolding Fred Phelps. Now that's very interesting. Interestingly, Fred Phelps made a good point that his whole purpose of John, John Rankin's whole purpose was attacking him. And you heard it in the introduction when he was talking about Phelps' website. Now, interestingly enough, Westboro Baptist Church is anti-everything, so they're always taking the defensive position. They're against everything. But in this debate, it was John Rankin taking the defensive position. I find that very fascinating. And it shows me the folly of the people going against Westboro Baptist Church because they become even more defensive than Fred Phelps. Both of them had some interesting stuff to say and Fred Phelps actually had a point. He did take it from the Bible and Rankin had some new positions. But I wonder what was the whole purpose of him debating. Now it's not as if Fred Phelps is attracting all these millions of followers and taking all these souls away from the true gospel. He doesn't have very many followers as everyone loves to point out. So it's not like Rankin needs to be on a crusade to save souls. So what is he trying to do? In that book, Your Worst Enemy, it mentions how if you are really intelligent, you like to put a lot of handicaps on yourself. And I think that's what Fred Phelps is trying to do in many cases. But what is John Rankin trying to do? If he beats Fred Phelps, so what? He beat a bad man. But if he loses, you lost to a madman. And his performance in the debate wasn't a sweeping victory. Now, he did make some points, certainly, but even some people in the comments didn't think he won the debate. I don't think he had an overwhelming victory. So why did he debate Fred Phelps? Why did John Rankin debate Fred Phelps?